What's up guys, we're looking at over my head or cable car by the fray today. You're going to have the capo, it needs to be on fret 1. Alright, now we pretty much have 4 chords for most of this song. Alright, C9, E minor, G, sometimes we have A minor, sometimes we have D. Alright, so let's just start with this verse. For the verse we're going to have C9, E minor, G, right, so, I never knew, I never knew that everyone was falling through, that everyone... We have C add 9 to begin with, so you want your middle finger on the A string, third fret, first finger's on the D string, second fret, we have open G, and then at the bottom, and for most of the song we have the third finger on the B string, third fret, and we have fourth finger on the E string, third fret. All right. For E minor, we're just gonna move along. So look, these two stay here for all three chords. It's just the top that change. So C add nine, then E minor. We're gonna have first finger on the A string, second fret, and middle finger on the D string, second fret. We also have open the low E string for this chord. All right, so from here, just move along. Then for G, we're just gonna move this middle finger up to the third fret on the E string. And we have G, which is similar to C. So but all three chords are similar, right? It's important to realize that the bass note is what's really changing here, so C, C, E, E. We do it three times. Then we'll have. We have this A minor, G, and D. So let me show you these three chords, and that's pretty much the whole song. We can just look at rhythms after that. A minor 7, we have open A. We have middle finger on the D string, 2nd fret. We have open G. We have 1st finger, 1st fret on the B string, and open E. Okay, G we know. Then we have D with F sharp in the bass if you want. So we have open A, open D. 1st finger on the G string, 2nd fret. 3rd finger on the B string, 3rd fret. And middle finger on the E string, 2nd fret. Alright. If you want to, add the thumb to the 2nd fret of the E string. To have F sharp in the bass. Okay. So let's go into the rhythms, we'll work through the whole song, alright. To begin with, we're going to have just one strum. One, two, three, four. 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 One, two, three. All right. Or if you want to, one down, 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 down. So we build up on that A minor. Okay, then the second half of the verse, we can keep that going. All I'm doing is going down, 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 Okay, so let's do this first verse together. All right, on four. One, two, one, two, three, four. I never knew, I never knew that everyone was falling through. That everyone I knew was waiting on a cue to turn and run when all I needed was the truth. But that's how it's gotta be. It's coming down to nothing more than apathy. I'd rather run the other way than stay and see The smoke in the stealth standing when it clears 
The chorus, we can really drive that rhythm. So down, 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 down. Okay, lots of down strokes, really driving this song. Okay, there's such a driving beat to it. For the chorus, we change the order of the chords. So we're gonna play C add nine, G, E minor, then D with F sharp in the bass. Now you might notice that sometimes for D, I take away my first finger. So you get this. You get this really nice sus shape, D sus, D sus uh, four. So that's an option for D, you can take the first finger off. All right. Right, for those of you that want to kickstart your guitar learning abilities so that you can perform one day, potentially make money and travel playing the guitar just like me, then click the link in the description, also in the comment section, and sign up to my premium lessons on my website, all right? And we'll get you started right away learning the guitar for real. The chorus, you just pump away. One, down, 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 Seconds left and all the time She's on your mind She's on your mind Let's rearrange I wish you were a stranger I could disengage Now, when we go into verse 2 we want less drive. So instead of down, 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 instead of this constant energy, for verse two it means to be more like down, 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 down. So on beats two and four, that's what you emphasize now. So one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Down, 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 down. Right, just think about the drums, that's what the drums are doing. Whereas in the chorus it was more like There was like every two strums emphasized. In verse two, just go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Right? Let's rearrange. I wish you were a stranger, I could disengage. To say that we agree and then never change. Stop in a bit until we all just get along But that's just regard You find another friend then you discard As you lose the argument in a cable car Hanging above as a canyon comes between Then we have another chorus, same as the first one. Okay, so again, we drive down, 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 all right. So I just want to point out that is a double chorus the second time round. Okay, we do the chorus twice, and then we come out into the bridge. So let me just show you what the bridge sounds like. We can use the verse chords, but it's a different rhythm feel. It's more half timey. Okay, so coming out the chorus. Um, Eight seconds left on all the time. She's on your mind. She's on. Oh, suddenly I've become part of your past. I'm becoming a part of the dawn last. I'm losing you and it's effortless. Without a sound, I lose sight of the ground and I throw around. Never thought that you wanted to bring it down. I won't let it go down till we touch it ourselves and everyone. So it's more of a down, 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 down. So one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, one, two, three. Never thought that you wanted to bring it down. I won't let it go down till we touch it. 
Now when we get to A minor, in the verse we would go Right? Well in the bridge, the bass line actually just stays on A. Alright, so just bear that in mind. I mean, you don't have to do that, but that is what the song does. So just so you know where I mean, talking about the Go down we touch it ourselves and Then it goes into the chorus. Now for this little breakdown chorus, I like to just keep it simple, so I just play C at 9, E minor, D, V, F sharp in the bass. I don't even bother with G, so I just go, and everyone knows I'm in over my head, from my head with eight seconds left and all the time she's on, your mind, she's on, your mind. Everyone knows she's on your mind. Everyone knows I'm in over my head. I'm in over my head. I'm over my everyone knows I'm in over. Then we go into the chorus, right? So as you can hear, by the simple fact that I took out the G chord, it just gave it a different vibe, right? And you're just playing very softly for the whole of that breakdown chorus. Now, obviously, you don't have to sing the exact same melody as he does, but it sound, the way he does it just keeps the chorus low. But it's still the chorus lyrics, if that makes sense. So, and everyone knows I'm in over my head, over my head with eight seconds left to all. Time, she's on your mind, she's on your mind. Everyone knows she's on your mind. Build it up. Everyone knows I'm in over my head, I'm in over my head, I'm over my. And on the word my, just do the last hit. Okay, so you build up that volume. Just so it builds up to the last chorus, and then bam, you come into the last chorus. Okay, and you can make the last chorus nice and loud. All right, and that's pretty much it. That's the whole song. So this is a great song if you're new to singing and you're a guy in particular. This is a bit lower for girls, but if you're a guy then this is such a good song to start with because it's a nice part of the range. It's not too high. It's, it's just a nice one to try and sing. All right. Uh, and the rhythms are fairly straightforward to sing along to. Okay. Uh, I recommend any f of the phrase songs for guys that are just starting out trying to play and sing. Okay. Or even if you're just starting out on guitar, you're not bothered about singing. All right. So I've also done a tutorial for You Found Me and also How to Save a Life by the same band, same singer. Um, also good songs to start trying to sing and play guitar. All right? And if you want to get out there playing, maybe some of you want to play in the, uh, if you're young, maybe at school. If you're older, maybe you want to go play at the local bar, local pub, local club, whatever. Uh, these are good songs to do, okay? Because it's just a good place to start with your vocal range. It's nice and low-ish. Alright, so thanks for watching guys. I hope this was a good lesson. I'll see you in the next one.